Hi, I'm Steven Shives, and people often ask me about how Runaway Campers got started as a business, and um, and so many times I tell the story, and maybe I oversimplify it at times because it's honestly has been a lot of work for the past um, uh, almost five years now, and um, and, and so. You know, when we got started, I'm actually standing here next to the very first uh, runaway camper prototype, as I called it back then. I never honestly intended to build another one. Um, you know, it was just kind of built out of necessity. And, and so I've been fortunate enough to be able to, to buy this back from the, the second owner um, this past year and, and be able to have this as kind of a, a memory maker. But um, you know, when I first built it, I, I wasn't even thinking about starting a business. I was just um, doing what I needed to do to, to support my family. And um, I, was, I was rebuilding a, a transit bus at the time, and I needed a transmission for one. I, and I actually found another identical um, transit bus that the body was just all shot, and, uh, had, but it had a good motor and transmission. So. Uh, I bought it and I took it back and I, I took the motor transmission out of it and uh, and then I went to the scrapyard to get rid of what was left and the scrapyard refused it. He said, I can't take that. There's more fiberglass on that thing than there is metal. So I took it back home and my wife was like, what are you doing? What's Where's that? I thought you were taking it away. And I said, no, they wouldn't take it. So, um, uh, so the best I can figure to do is I'm going to take a saw and chop it up into small enough pieces that I can um, I can take it off to the dump. And uh, while I was doing that, I started doing some measurements and, I, and I, I realized I had a wall section there with with three windows that was just slightly over eight feet long. And I thought, what can I build out of that section of windows? I mean, they're, they're nice, solid RV windows, a good solid wall section. And it's a it's an even eight feet. I can make something out of that standard uh, measurement. And, and so that's where this was was birthed out of. I mean, it was just that's where the three windows are, and that's actually the side walls of that bus. Um, it's the first and only unit that we ever built with three windows on each side. And and some people ask us, well, will you build another, or you know, why don't why don't you do that anymore? Um, it was just something that was done out of necessity, and and out of that was a business that was birthed that that a lot of people. You know, refer to it as the American dream. You know, the backyard business startup that um, you know, with American ingenuity and the opportunity that we have in this country to basically be anything we want to be and 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 share our ideas with you know with those around us. And and so it's been a tremendous blessing. And and I think back and I think you know what, if if that scrapyard would have taken that old junk bus when I took it in there the first time, runaway campers wouldn't be here today. And, and so often we don't see around the next corner in life. We don't always realize that some of the, the stumbling blocks or roadblocks that, that we uh, come up upon in life uh, are there that, that guide us or steer us in a, in a different direction that we've yet to see yet. And so I'm grateful uh, for some of the things that that have happened that have kind of moved us in different directions over the years. Some of the bumps and bruises that we've had. Um, I share some of those stories in, in a short book that I wrote called Breaking Camp. So if you want to hear the whole story, be sure and grab a copy of that. I hope you enjoy it. Um, but you know, the, the most exciting thing about this journey has been the people. We're, we're excited to be a part of, of hundreds and hundreds of people's lives uh, over the past few years as, as we've grown and stretched with this business. Um, we continue to, to research and, and do the best that we can to continue making a better and better product all the time um, for the money that you spend. And so, um, you know, the camper that obviously the camper we built in the beginning was not the camper that we built when we built the first 10. And then after the 10, things changed. And after 20 and 40 and 50, things changed. And now after over a thousand units, we've, you know, we just continue to make changes along the way to, to offer our customers the very best product for the money. And, uh, and so we're excited about that. We're, we're glad to be a part of so many people's lives and, uh, and to realize that what a blessing it is. Um, that when you invest in a runaway camper, you're not just investing in your own enjoyment. You're not just in investing in something that you're going to use for pleasure on, on the weekends every now and then. You're investing in the American dream. 
You're in investing in what this nation was founded on, the opportunities that we have to, to, to press forward through our ideas and through our circumstances and, and the, the dreams that we have um, to make the most of the life that we have to live. And so you're investing in that. You're investing in, in the lives of the families that, that build these campers, that it supports their families. And you're investing in, in communities, in our own community and, and the charities that we support. You're investing in, in work that we do in, in foreign countries to help impoverish children and families. And so we're grateful for that and for the part that our customers play in that as well as well as the support and the prayers that come in and the encouragement. Many times relationships just, just uh, we get cards, we get letters and emails and phone calls um, on a regular basis of people telling us how much the runaway has enhanced their life, that it's allowed them to meet new people and make new friends and they even have a marriage on the books now because uh, a couple met uh, through their runaway campers. And so we're excited to be part of people's lives and we're excited that um, we can share it with you as well and and so stop in and see us at, at our sales center in central florida or maybe we'll run into each other in the uh, out when we're out and about at a campground or a shopping center one day but uh, i hope you have a great day and i hope the story encourages you uh, to keep pressing through in everything in life and and make it the very best that you possibly can god bless you talk to you soon